After you purchase a home, especially if you are a first-time home buyer, you might know or you might think that you have in your mind a budget that you can work to do the repairs, the new furniture of the house, everything that you want to do to the house. Sometimes, due to the budget, you might just do a lot of things at the end instead of the front. This is one of the reasons why I want to talk to you about home warranty. How important it is for us as first-time home buyers to get one of those and why? After we purchase the house, now we find out what's next. So next step is put the house together so we can move in and feel great as it's our home. A lot of the times we find things that we didn't see when we did the final walkthrough, when we did the inspection or something that the appraisal didn't come up on the report. This is when we find out that maybe the dishwasher is no longer working, that maybe the AC unit after a week that we moved in, it's not working anymore. This is one of the main reasons why first-time home buyers should also get a home warranty. I am referring to first-time home buyers because repeat clients already know. They already experience what you are about to leave. They already know everything that could or most things that could happen to the house once you move in. Especially if you are planning on, I don't know, focus on the garden first, for example. That's where your budget or main budget might go. Some people is the furniture, some people is let me just re-roof everything, some people is let's just get the house, flooring. It's a lot of expenses once you purchase your home the way or to transform the house the way you would like to have it. What is the home warranty? What is it good for? The home warranty ensures all the appliances in your property, meaning that if your dishwasher or your fridge or your um, washer and dryer do break, then you just pay a minimum or kind of like a copay for in between 70 to 100 bucks. Somebody will come here and will fix it for you. Now, if it's not fixable, they'll replace it. And there you have an opportunity to also to do a small or a big upgrade on the new appliances or anything that you decide. AC unit, especially in Las Vegas, with this heat during summertime, of course you cannot afford to be without an AC unit. You have to call someone right away and usually someone to fix that, it's pretty expensive or it's pretty pricey. Well, depending on what you're going through with the AC unit, right? Now, an example, if you have a home warranty, you'll call someone, they'll get you in a work order and it gives you like a timeline between 24 to 48 hours to get to your house and fix it. If it's not fixable, again, it's going to be replaced. You wanna make sure that you have that in place. Also, the pool or the equipment to make the pool work, it's also covered if you purchase the extended pool home warranty. It's super important for you to have it. You do not want to have more expenses that you already have. Honestly, putting the budget where it should be is the best way to keep it. You can sidetrack that if you don't have a home warranty and now you're getting into new expenses because you don't have anything to cover. Trust me, it's pretty pricey. For example, I'm going to give you a personal experience that I went through and it's kind of funny though. So the other house that I purchased last, I moved into the house. My sister came into my house like a week after I moved in. She is from Mexico, we are from Mexico. She didn't know how to use the dishwasher and she thought that the dish soap that I had on the top on the counter was going into the dishwasher and she pours them. 30 minutes later, she calls me and said, Sandra, it smells like the house is burning, but I don't know where the smell is coming from. And then she FaceTimed me, she ran down the stairs and I saw all the bubbles coming out of the dishwasher. Yeah that thing was broken for sure. <laughs> it was pretty funny though, but that really realized, made me realize that I could save a lot of money without home warranty. 
we ended up replacing it. I paid an extra because I want to upgrade it that since it was pretty old and that really made my day. Trust me, that's a nice and wise decision. What do you guys think? Don't you guys think it's important? Give me your feedback. This is something that I really like to have a home warranty in every household.